Hello, ladies and gentlemen of the big tubes. It's me, Sabrina, with yet a really another amazing video that you didn't want. And it's another book haul because Sabrina acquired books because she has a problem. Do I have a problem, Amanda? A little bit. She still loves me though. I've been wanting to book haul these books for a while that I bought like two months ago that I bought at a bargain. So I just wanted to show you all the books that I got here for really cheap. Let's start. So the first book is the best book I've ever gotten in my bookshelf. The most quality, amazing, spectacular book I've ever gotten into my hands. And it's Hot Guys and Baby Animals. I don't know what, what I like the most. It's the shirtless guy looking at me so sexily or the puppy. I think I'm going more towards the puppy because that puppy is cute. So basically this is just a picture book that features a lot of cute guys and a lot of cute animals. Like we got here Adam and Minky. And we also have Adam and, and it's a goat because goats are sexy. This is Brent and Rufus. Isn't that adorable? Guys, I need a calendar that has this. And I got this for 50 cents. So obviously I have to get it. I buy it. Have Merry Christmas. <laughs> so the next book that I bought here for my book haul is a book that is in French because I am so culturally diverse and smart. And it's Le, Le Mavir de la France. My boyfriend would totally kill me for that pronunciation. But it's basically, I think it translates to France's Marvels. And it's just a picture book of photography of beautiful landscapes and cities and places in France. And I like photography. I, I like France, so, and it was only $1.50, so I was like, no, $1.25 actually, and I was like, this is cute, and I might learn a little bit of French, maybe, hopefully. <laughs> Thank you, royal book holder. So the next book that I bought at the book sale is Everything is Illuminated by Jonathan Sephiron Flower. I have no idea what it is about. I don't know, but I've seen it in a lot of like top 100 lists and the top like thousand a thousand books you need to read before you die. And I think it's really cool. I mean, if it was one dollar, I have nothing to complain about. But yeah, if you have read this book and you like it, comment down below. Grab it. Grab it. And what? what? Next two books I want to feature, I didn't actually get them in a sale, but I got them sent by the publisher that was really cool. And we have booktube tours and they send them to me in an exchange of an honest review. However, they send them to me to the wrong address and kind of screwed things over. So that's why I haven't done a review. But it is the True Rain series by Jennifer Ann Davis with book one, The Key. Book two, Red. Book three. War. It's a high fantasy series, which is a usual ploy of chosen girl doing cool kick-ass things. And I haven't read it because college. But I'll read them soon and we'll be posting a review. But yeah, thank you Booktube Tours for helping me get these books. They smell really nice. Thank you. And it's The Bell Jar by Sylvia Plath. And thank you Ashley Nagel for this book. You are really cool. And this is a uh, Sylvia Plath is a poet and she wrote this novel like sometime before she died. And it's basically like an autobiographical novel set into a fictional setting. And it's a lot about her with depression and it's really emo and I'm really into emo stuff. And I really like Sylvia Plath. She's such a good poet. And I'm just really excited to learn about, to learn more about her life and learn about her struggles and analyze the crap out of this. So this is a book that exploded in the book tubes around a year or two. And I got it at the book sale for $2. And it's Jodie Picoult and Samantha Van Leer's Between the Lines. And it has a really nice cover. And this is a book um, basically kind of like Inkheart in which there is this girl who can bring characters out of books. So like she reads this book and she loves the main character there. Then out of nowhere this character who's a prince comes out. And uh, just this is my dream. I really want this to happen in real life. I wish I had this power. How do I get this? So I need to like get a degree in bringing characters out of books because I just need Mr. Darcy and Mr. Rochester and Maxon from the selection and Warner from Shatter Me to be real so I can love them all. <laughs> I just love fictional books. Boys. Ew. <laughs> it's a collection of four novels by H.G. Wells. I haven't read a full H.G. Wells book because 
They're long, but this includes The Time Machine, The Island of Dr. Moreau, The Invisible Man, and The War of the Worlds. And this is basically some sci-fi and kind of like gothic, scary, horror stories, novels. And I'm into that crap a lot. So the last book that I bought is a book that really goes well with my aspirations and my dreams of joining the Illuminati. This is the illustrated edition of The Da Vinci Code by Dan Brown and I had the original one but I gave it away because I found this one for $1.25. Illustrated, it has photography and I've never read The Da the, the Vinci Code but I want to soon because it has to do a lot with like renaissance and conspiracies and of course Illuminati. The Triangle! That this book haul was a success. In total, I only spent seven dollars in all these books, which I consider a win. I am uh, my my new channel name. Thank you. My new channel name should be the Frugal Booktuber because I am cheap AF. If you have read any of these books, please comment down below and thank you for watching. And if you want to see more videos featuring Amanda, comment down below because <laughs> she's beautiful and. She will do great in the YouTubes. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe because if you're watching this video to subscribe, I, I will find you and, you and I will kill, kill you. you. They're a little so psycho. Just a little bit, but it's okay. <laughs> so thank you so much for watching, guys, and happy reading. Bye!